Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Epi Gamer Josh, and I'm back with another video. Today's video is a monthly update vlog for the month of September. So in this vlog, we'll be looking back at what has happened in September on my channel, and we'll be looking forward into October for what is coming your way in October. So to kick things off, guys, um, I was supposed to be doing this video from... Uh, well, whilst I was walking on the canal with my dog, but Mother Nature had other ideas and the weather also had other ideas as well. Um, so, I will do that in a different... Well, I will do a vlog on walking on the canal with my dog another time. But for, for now though, guys, um, I'm here at home and... Basically, let's kick off with what happened at the beginning of September. So, to start off with, um, I came back from a 30 day suspension from PlayStation, which uh, was met with positive, uh, you know, positive news by my subscribers, and I was able to stream for you guys again. Now, um, obviously, I did stream WWE, and I, stream I got back up and running with my streams. Um, throughout September, I have gained a bunch load of subscribers, and I am proud to say that I have now passed my 200 subscriber target, um, <clears throat> which is absolutely fantastic, so thank you all for coming and subscribing to the channel. Now, moving on to uh, October and towards the end of the year as well, um, I do have two more targets for you guys to, to try and chase, if you can. So, if you guys can get me to 500 subscribers by the end of the year, so December the 31st, I will do a 18 hour stream on GTA, something I've never ever done before. But if you guys can go one step further and get me to 1000 subscribers, I will kick off the new year with a 24 hour GTA stream for you. Just for you guys, as a reward, and a thank you for getting me to, you know, the 1,000 or 500 subscribers. But, anyways, um, <clears throat> moving on from that. So, throughout September, I've been streaming for you guys, as per usual. But, I have been hit with another setback. Unfortunately, the person that got me banned for 30 days, um, he, he or she made a new account and started getting salty. For absolutely no reason at all. So, obviously I uh, I got salty back in an attempt to make him cry or make him quit playing the PS. And I said some things which got me into trouble with PlayStation. Thus meaning a 60 day ban. So, I can't, well, in, lim in uh, simple terms, I can't stream my proper content until at least the 18th of November when my suspension ends but guys um, <clears throat> I have been able to find a loophole which is to create a temporary account and to stream using that which uh, I have done so far and I'll be doing it throughout October as well and as soon as the 18th of November comes I will be going back onto my original account so in terms of streaming, guys, um, <clears throat> I'm going to be limited to what I can stream. And every stream I do will have its limitations. But it is what it is, and, um, you know, I shouldn't have been too harsh on that salty person. So, September, in a way, has been a good uh, month. I mean... Uh, I've confirmed that a Premier League vlog will be taking place in October, which I will get onto that in just a sec. But um, for the month of September, I'd like to thank all of you guys for coming and subscribing to me and making me smash that 200 subscriber goal. My next target is now 500, then 1,000. But uh, we're just going day by day, guys, and hopefully soon I will reach those targets. So, moving on to what's going on in October then. So, on the 30th of October, as you guys know, I have a football match day vlog coming up. 
it will be my first ever Premier League match day vlog and the first ever time I've gone to see a Premier League match. The match cho the match I chose is Burnley versus Brentford. Um, I could have gone to Leeds, but obviously with their stadium always being full with Leeds fans, obviously wanting to see their team in the Premier League. Um, obviously, I decided to go a little more further outfield, further afield to Burnley. Obviously, Burnley and Leeds are the closest Premier League grounds to where I live, so I decided I decided to get a ticket for Burnley. And let me tell you something, guys. The seat, the seat that I have to vlog that game on the thirtieth of October is absolutely wonderful. The views from the seats are absolutely awesome, and it only cost me thirty pound. So I can't complain. Thirty pound to go watch a Premier League match. Crack on! I, I can do that any day. So I'll be look. I'll be watching that um, live. So. So now you should see photos of what the view from my sea should look like. You have to admit guys, those seats are absolutely fantastic. For the price, I cannot complain. And also... The other thing is, oh, the other thing as well is, I could actually be on match of the day <laughs> if uh, whoever, if someone scores a goal at the end where I'm sat, I could actually see myself on match of the day, which is absolutely fantastic. I hope to see myself on match of the day. If I don't, then I don't. But obviously, um, it. It's a massive vlog. I mean, it's my second ever match day vlog, and I've taken some constructive criticism from uh, people who obviously commented on my first match day vlog. They said it was good, but it needed improvements and tweaks here, there, and everywhere. So yeah, I'm looking forward to that. Now, the other, qu the one question I want to ask all of you viewers and all of you subscribers is. I'm a streaming YouTuber. I'm most of my content is from streams, but obviously I have done, uh, you know, I have added a bit more variety to my channel by obviously um, adding in the match day vlogs and everything. But I want to ask you guys an important question: Should I do more vlogs? Say hi to the camera, babe. So guys, that is my fiance there. Say hi, babe. Hi. Uh, she's a bit boring, but she just got out of the shower. So, anyways, guys, um, as I was saying, should I do more vlogs of the events that I want to go to? For example, um, there's an event coming up at Manchester at the AO Arena, which is WWE Live, as you can see. Um, the pictures now. Now, would you like to see me vlog a WWE live event? If you do, then say so in the comments below. And also, I would have another um, event vlog as well planned, if it all goes well. And that is to watch the Premier League of Darts, either from the First Direct Arena in Leeds, or again the AO Arena in Manchester. So guys, would you like to see me doing do more vlogs to add more variety to my channel? If not, then that's absolutely okay. But if you do, then make sure you say so in the comments below. Um, <clears throat> anyways, guys, um, I hope you've enjoyed this video, and I hope you're looking forward to what's on offer in October. Um, if you if you did enjoy this video, then don't forget to hit that like button. And if you are a new viewer or you're not yet subscribed, then come and subscribe to the channel to see more awesome epic content from me, Epic Gamer Josh. And I can see you sticking your tongue out there, babe. <laughs> um, so then, guys, that is it for this video. I get like I said. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you have, don't forget to hit that like button. And if you are a new viewer to the channel or not yet subscribed, then come and subscribe to the channel to see more 
awesome content from me, Epic Gamer Josh. So then, guys, um, later on tonight, I will be streaming the first episode of GTA 5 Story Mode. So I hope you guys are looking forward to that. But in the meantime, stay safe, stay positive, and peace out, guys. Do you want to say anything, babe? Do you want to say bye to the viewers? No? Okay. Peace out, guys, and I'll see you soon.